everyone just come back because guess what yes I've got another parcel so I thought today I'd show you this parcel on the diamond painting then I thought I'd show you then what I do to the canvas and everything else before I start doing it because I've run out of one to do so I thought well I might as well start this one so I thought I'd show you how I prepare it and how I get started so let's get in it This is the one I've ordered off um, eBay, I'm guessing. Oops. Usual tray. Usual beads. No DMCA numbers though, which is a bit of a thing because it's always handy if you've got them to pair them up. Oh, and this is the canvas. No picture. Ah, it's a wolf. Oh, what's it called? Dreamcatcher. Can you see that then? Just make it has no picture. If I can find a picture, I'll, I will try and insert it, but I'm making no promises because I haven't got a clue how you insert things. But I will go and have a go, see if I can find one. If not, just very sorry. So that's the one I got, and I'll tell you now where I got it from. Let me have a look. Wolf Dreamcatcher. I ordered it on the 8th. Sorry if I just shut the camera, sorry. I ordered it on the 8th, so it was delivered yesterday. What was the date yesterday? 16th. No. Sixteenth, I think. So what's that? It's eight days. Not too bad. And I got it from an eBay seller called um, W S H I L. No, one two three four five six stroke four or dash four. So W S H I one two three four five six stroke four. So let's have a look at it. I got to admit, I don't know if you can see, but the letters look very, very clear. I think I can't see any that you can't make out what they are. So that's the chart, and there's 25 colours on there so it looks quite good the glue is lovely intact there's no thing there's a crease in the paper but I don't think it's in the canvas no fine that's pretty much got it thing so then what I do is I just put that to the one side so I can see the the numbers how many do we should have so we should have 25 so 1 to 25 sorry about the that then let's have a look 21 to 25, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 15, 15, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yep, all there. And it looks like there's a nice amount of each one. Oh, what's oh look, that bag must have burst. It's not fallen out though. I'm surprised at that. I thought that bag must have burst, so they put them in a, a little doodah bag. So once I've got to there, what I do, I don't know whether it's right or wrong, but I used to do this when I first, the first few I did, is I just used to cut the corners, tip them in my tray, and then get a clothes peg and stick them on 
until I got because I work in like one corner so I'd work in that bit first and then I'd move my way up and then I'd come here and some people go straight across I suppose it's up to you whichever way is easiest but I try to do it where I'm not going to get my arm in it because I am very accident pro and very messy so I was doing that which is okay until you try and tip them back in with the green one and used to go everywhere and if I opened it all the way along I used to tip them everywhere so then I went and got some of these and I can't remember there was a lady that I watched right at the very beginning said these came in the tray so I thought oh they must mean that you use got to get these and use them I think have I ever had any bags in tray? I think once I had some bags in trays I think it's only once so you get like three bags sometimes you just get I think these come in about hundred in a bag for two pounds seven or something off eBay or Amazon that's all they are so just get a load of them and then all I do is open the bag first and this is where you find that you need your nails to open them just open your bag there's no right way or wrong way or and then all I do whoop a daisy she drops them what am I like where's my tree okay. is I tip them all in there I used to use the bag and tip it from the bag but then I used to miss the hole I know say so how can you miss it but I did that's better a bit of a hole And then all I used to do is tip it in, or well, still do, I don't know what I say used to do. And then all I do is start putting them in there. So they're all in there. And then I just literally cut all that information. Some of them have got the DMC numbers on, which is great. Some of them have just, so that number there is, is relating to the canvas number. So it's W, whoops, sorry, W854, and it's saying it's number one, which is the brown, which it is. So then all I do is I stick that inside there, put it up there out the way, get another bag, and do the same until we've got all of them done. I mean, you don't have to do this. A lot of um, ladies I see, I've noticed, have got these little um, plastic containers. Well, I haven't seen, because I live in Mid Wales, which is in the middle, absolutely in the middle of nowhere. I couldn't find any around here. So this is my option instead. But I suppose if I, want, if I get loads of them, then I probably will need the plastic ones or something to store these in little containers to store these in so is how is everybody today what are you all up to what have you got as I said I've just been about six weeks I think I worked it out I've been doing these and I absolutely love them and I wrote on one of the pages last night it's been six weeks I've done six I think not very big ones uh, I think a 30 by 30 I don't know why that went off then. Um, my camera just switched itself off for some reason. As I was saying, I've been doing 30 by 30s and 40 by 30s, which are quite nice sizes. I've done six. Um, and I've got, I don't know, is it five on order? Well, four now. But you go on these sites, and how do you stop yourself buying them all? Because I want them all. I, want, I was looking last night. On Peggy Buys, and I'm not bought off Peggy Buys yet, yet, but I was looking at her site at the um, what do you call them when there's more than one picture? You've got a picture there, and then picture by the side, and then that one, and then they go smaller. Can't think what they're called, but you know the ones I mean. They're all on one canvas, but there's like this split up. Um, I've seen a nice African scene because I like my African stuff. Um, I think it was only £10 something 
And then I saw another one which was a home one, and then another one I think was an animal one, and then another one which was a flowered scene, and and I thought I can't I can't be spending this money, so I had to come off it, and I was good I didn't buy. But I guarantee you tonight when I'm lying in bed I'll be back on it, get the iPad out, and then I'll be back on looking again. But it's so hard to choose, isn't it? There's so many different varieties. I'll tell you what I haven't done, is I have never done a square one. So um, please let me know below what the square ones are like. Are they as easy as a round one? They look seem to be more difficult because you have to like, somebody said you have to line them up better. Because, excuse me, I'm just having a drink. Um, and I'm thinking, oh God, have you got to be completely spot on for it to work or... I mean the circles you just put on and roughly line them up as near as you can. So I don't know. Oh look, there's a hitchhiker in there. He says he wants to be on the the canvas. I'll take him. Oop. Is he gonna come out? Yeah, he must be number six. Yeah, six is that card. So we'll leave him there and he can go in the bag with number six. Oh, we need another little bag. Yeah, so I don't know whether to order a small square one and have a go at that one. Just in case, because I'm a bit worried of buying a big one in case I, I can't or don't like it or can't do it. I mean, they say so, everybody can do it, and I suppose it is right, even a little one can do it. I mean, my Jessie is 11. Um, she, she likes doing, she's just started on hers. Millie is 14, although she, Millie's out of action at the moment because she's just had an operation on her foot she's just taken over one of mine i only got it out of the packet put on the table and it was of a skull tree thing and she's taken that she's taken a liking to that so she wants to have a go and i mean they had no problem doing it so i suppose anybody can do it you know but i don't know about the square and i'm not very confident person you know what I mean? Um, I'll have a go at things, but I never seem to master anything. You know, I'll have a little go and I can get so far, but this just seems so nice. And I can also do it in the evenings because if I'm not sleeping very well, um, it doesn't matter because I can come down now in the night. I'm not causing anybody any noise or anything. I can just sit quietly in the kitchen and do this and it relaxes me. And it takes my mind off the pain sometimes. But yeah, I don't suppose you want to listen to me prattling on. So um, yeah, so if you just do it this way, oh, there's a green one there. I say, and then you've just got to open and shut the bags as and when you need them. But I said, everybody's got their own techniques. And as they say, nothing is wrong. Nothing is right. It's what suits you. So as I say, they've all got the numbers on so it's easy to find them. And that's all I do. So I hope you like that little follow along with me. My camera keeps cutting out so I'm not sure whether it's where it finished and I think it's when I was said I've, I've done them. Anyway, thanks for watching. And um, like I say, big thanks to the ones that are new to subscribing and obviously thanks to the ones that have stuck by me and keep watching me. I do appreciate, as I say, I always try and sub back. So if you've subbed me and I haven't subbed back, um, doesn't always tell me who's subbed, I've noticed. So I haven't subbed you back. Please, please let me know because um, I will I will do it. I'm a big thing for that. Um, yeah, so I said the next video, I'm not sure. I've got a glossy box that I might put up that Millie wants to look at to open so I might put that up but I have got um new frog order coming which was ordered on the 6th of January so I'm hoping that'll be here before long that's an owl uh heart flower heart shaped skull and a horse fall they're not I think the biggest is 30 by 30 so when they come I'll show you them so any questions or whatever please let me know and again thank you again for taking the time out of your data Stop by and watch me. Love to you all. Bye.